Hello everybody, welcome to this um, yes birthday release from um, Chrome Spring Stamps and uh, today I make a video with this stamp set and I'm doing three cards for you starting with the first card of course I am using this stamp as it uh, meant to be <laughs> and um, yes I'm using this um, what is it in English lucky leaf uh, I don't know the word and um, I'm starting with um, a watercolor paper <laughs> and um, um, oh, sorry. and I emboss this stamp in white um, because I wanted to do a real chrome spring card do you remember um, the, the first time we, you met her on Instagram um, she created so many um i can't describe it and not especially not in english um she 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 created kind of um um shape and made her special um stripes or lines inside of this and now i can tell it i tried to copy this i wanted to make her a card for a birthday i think and try to um i, I colored a flower i think and made her chrome spring lines and wanted to um, color it with my copics and this card has never seen anybody because it was so ugly so um never nobody can copy her but now we have her stamps and um this is why i wanted i wished i could describe it much more better because my heart feels it a little bit better than my mouth can say it <laughs> So I wanted to make a Chrome Spring card and um, yes, this is why I tried to color it like she maybe would color the stamp. But because um, it's Boca, it's me, so I cannot mix up so many colors, sorry. And uh, the greatest thing I could do is mix up three greens. And um, yes, the last green hurts a little bit my color non-mixing motions, but I was brave to um, finish this card now it's it's a kind of three greens and it's okay so and um, yes and for finishing my coloring I thought there needed some darkness around these um, white lines from the embossing so I wanted um, to pop up these lines and that is why I'm choosing um, a gray zig color watercolor pen um at least I think this card is now a little bit too maybe too sad, <laughs> not happy again and happy enough um because of this gray, but I didn't know which other color I could have chosen because I cannot mix colors, you know, and um yeah, so I took gray, but I think the effect to pop up these um um white lines is the how I wanted to have this. Oh. <laughs> so and um, after this coloring I took my heat tool to dry the card and I speak faster than you can see what I'm doing sorry I wait a little bit <laughs> and um, yes then I come to the sentiment and this is um, um, the sentiment says I feel so lucky to call you my friend and I think it's it's a great sentiment for this uh, stamp set and um, um, again, I embossed, this, embossed it in white. This is um, Hero Art embossing pulver in white <laughs> from Hero Art. Oh God! And um, yes, I cut it a little bit smaller. This piece of paper and um, round the edges with my corner edges tool <laughs> and put it on the card. I don't know what to say. Um, the most of the times I working not with a plan, so it's very difficult for me to explain you something like a plan in my videos. So, but I hope you have a little bit fun um, without great explanations. So I position this sentiment in the middle of the card, and um, now I am putting I put this on my card base. I am with double sided foam tape. As always on my card, I love my foam tape. And uh, to finish this card, I um, use some sequins, and I choose um, bigger um, 
clear sequins and smaller black sequins. I'm not sure. I think they are from Pretty Pink Posh. So, and um, yes, I put them on the card with um, multimedia mud from Ranger. <laughs> and yes. <laughs> so, this is, I'm talking now very slowly, this is the finish of my first card. Yes, and now we come to the second card. Now please take some tissues and you have to be strong. Uh, I cut this stamp. I feel so sorry. Um, I already asked Maria if she will be angry with me when she is seeing this video and sees how I cut her stamp. But she was she she was cool and said, "No, I like it. If you if somebody think a little bit different, <laughs> yes." But my first thought when I've seen this stamp set was, "Oh, there are four hearts." So I cut one heart apart, and yes, now I'm doing some heart cards, of course. And because I am a pinky girl, this card gets pink. So again, I um, distressed this heart with uh, white embossing powder, and now I remembered to use my distress stains. Did I say distress? I embossed it. So, and um, I think these distress stains bladders. You use only one time and then you think, oh, the, I can't use it all the time. So you forget them uh, a year and then comes a day, today, when you uh, find out, oh yeah, I can use them. And um, it makes so much fun to do these splatters. And also I'm using these distress stains for creating my background uh, paper for the sentiment. And um, this sentiment is I love you. It's from a different stamp set, but it's also from the newest release. And um, I will show you the next days on my blog a lot of cards I made with all these awesome stamps from um, the new release. And um, but if you are um, so, what is not jealous? It's curious? I think curious. Then please hop to the shop and um, take a. Take a view, take a watch, take a to the whole release. It's really awesome. And yes, this is near to the end of the card too. I put this card panel on my card base and um, put the sentiment on the heart. And this was enough for me. Because, um, yeah, it's a little bit kind of simple. You have all these bladders and um, uh, something less is more. Ah, so, yes. I love you. And I love this stamp. <laughs> so, hurry up, Burka. So, yes. This is the end of card two. And now we come to the last card. And I have to say it's my favorite card. Yes, I um, stay at my heart stamp. My own heart stamp. <laughs> I feel so sorry for... Um, hurting the stamp and I stamped it um, four times or yes two and a half <laughs> um, on this um, watercolor card stock card base and again I embossed it in white don't know why I only do cards with white embossing and again I used my distress stain but not with splatters I colored it in and then um, I um, add some water for letting the color do some magic or um, look do not look like so straight. So um, <laughs> sorry, I, I'm not drunk really, <laughs> but today I have no words for this. So I wanted to have the um, color do some special things for me. So, and also I added some drops in the same color for have for having some extra interest on this card. Yes, I, you have to watch the German video. It's a little bit better. <laughs> so, and um, yes, um, I always dried it with my heat tool between all these steps. And now I needed a sentiment and I needed a long sentiment. That is why I didn't took a stamp from the new release. Um, I took this um, birthday, happy birthday to you die from Lawn Fawn to cut out this black word and found that it's 
Ah. You cannot see it good on the card. So that is why I need some of these um, clear paper. What is the... Uh, wait, I uh, search for the... Vellum is a word. I took some vellum um, and cut it in stripes, but not with my scissor, only with my hand, because it looks a little bit more um, edgy. <laughs> or I have no word for this, but I even had no word in German for this. So, And I glue it around this card with my um, tape runner. That's the best way you, you can use a vellum. Um, find a place um, you can glue it where nobody can see it. <laughs> and also with my tape runner I uh, put this um, sentiment cutting thing on the card. The sentiment on the card. And this is... Um, and now you can see it a little bit better. And now you know what I mean. And this is the reason why I took some vellum. But I took a small stripe of vellum because I do not want it to cover all these hearts. And um, yes, you you can believe me, this color looks on this video and on the pictures not so great. It's also a little bit mm, not so funny. Oh, here I do the eye dot. <laughs> um, but I had this card in my hands today and uh, I was so glad about that. The color is in, in real life looking so beautiful with, with, and with his hearts. And I, really, it's my favorite card from all these three. So you are at the end of the video. My English is over now. I thank you so much for watching. Um, go to the shop and uh, find or uh, look for this new release. It's really, really, really awesome. And happy birthday, Maria, for one year. Your shop. Bye-bye. <laughs>